Hi everyone, I'm Rose and in this video we are going to be reviewing the Alter Ego palettes and they did go ahead and send me their entire lash collection on over. These are $5 each. I'll let you guys know in the video what I thought of them and if they are even worth our $5. So thank you so much to Alter Ego for sending some products over. I am so happy that but I will be giving you guys an honest opinion of every single lash that I have tried on and what I thought about the palette. If it was a hit or miss on this, it reminds me very, very similar to who beauty you guys will see how it blends and how it applies and if you guys are a loyal subscriber thank you so so much we are almost to 3,000 subscribers that's insane but if you are a loyal subscriber and you are always commenting on my youtube channel i just want to thank you guys so so much it honestly means the world to me yeah guys we are going to be reviewing these lashes and the palettes i'll have everything linked down below so you guys can see where you can get your own lashes and your own palettes this video is a little bit long and we'll just get started with the video i'm gonna first start out with the eyeshadow palette which is the aurora palette i believe they do have three different palettes to choose from so this was one of them and honestly the packaging is like velvety. I love the packaging on this. It's not that plastic material that Morphe has and it's not really too much like a cardboard feel. It is magnetic and then on the back you can see the shades. It's actually really, really pretty. It is cruelty free. This is just how the palette looks. So pretty. I love when palettes come with the mirror because I honestly use the mirrors when the palettes do come with it. Honestly, packaging the shades, the color shades, and the mirror sold me with it already. And this whole palette does come out to $16, which is not bad. A $16 palette versus a lot of other palettes that are out right now that have very similar color schemes to it. I'm gonna do a couple swatches so that way we can see how the formula works now. So I'm gonna use my arm. She's a little hairy, but it's okay. This one I'm gonna go ahead and swatch is this shade called Dawn. That's a pretty purple pink shade. I don't know if the camera's capturing it. So the next one I'm gonna do is Nova Maroon shade or burgundy shade. So Nova will go right here. It's a little blotchy, but with shades like that, normally they're always blotchy. I'll do two more. I'll do Flare next, which is this one. Ooh, that's a pretty color. I'll do this one, which is Stellar. That's pretty. So the pigmentation is there. They do have a little bit of fallout, especially this one from Flare. You can see it kind of messed up the palette a little bit, but that's okay, that's fine. I really don't care about that. So I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you guys in and we'll get started with an eye look real quick. I think I'm gonna do something really, really simple. I'm gonna go ahead and use Star first. Just go all over that eyelid with a nice big fluffy brush. Next, I'm taking flare and just buffing that all out. I'm kind of taking it out a little bit. And I'm going to take shine and just blend above. Next, I'm going to be taking radiance. You know, right on my lid as if I were to be doing a cut crease. I'm also going to go ahead and spray it with some Morphe spray just so that way it's a lot more pigmented. Wow, you can really see the pigmentation in this. Okay, last I'm going to take Twilight. I'm just gonna put that in the outer corner. All right guys, that is the look that I'm going to keep it at. I really, really loved how it looks, honestly. It's so easy to achieve, very blendable. I did have to build up a little bit with the products, especially with Flare. I feel like I had to use a couple more times to build up, which isn't a problem. For 16 bucks for a palette is really, really good price. 
but you guys also can use roll school 10 for 10 percent off so it will come out to 14 dollars and 40 cents so now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the lashes so they did send over seven pairs of lashes this is insane it's like they knew that i needed lashes because i just ran out of lashes so this is perfect so these lashes again are cruelty free has them right in the back i'll go ahead and try each single one on so you guys can go ahead and see this is what the packaging looks like it's very sleek black again it has that like velvety suede um, material on it these are only five dollars each and again you can go ahead and use that discount code to save you some 10 percent off which is a really really good price i think i'm going to start with these ones first so this is called royal they're very very natural honestly I go for lashes like this. I personally don't like to have very dramatic lashes on. But to each their own, honestly, there's so many lashes here that you guys can get that very dramatic. I'll show you guys some later on, but I'm going to start with the natural ones first and then build up. So I do have to go ahead and cut them because they do not fit my eyelids completely, which is fine. I normally have to cut all my lashes. I honestly feel like you don't have to buy such expensive lashes to achieve, an, to achieve a look. I can't even talk. I feel like I can never talk in any of my damn videos. The glue that I'm using, by the way, if you guys care, is the dual glue. I honestly love this one. Why did I all of a sudden forget how to put lashes on? That's pretty. I love these ones. They're so, so pretty. I love it so, so much. It's not too dramatic, which I love. You can still see like the eyeshadow. I don't know if you guys can see it. There it goes. But the band's not too thick, which is perfect. I hate when the bands are super, super thick. All right, guys. So for the next one, it's going to be plush a little bit more dramatic honestly i'm looking at the rest of them and they're a lot more dramatic than the first one so if you guys don't like natural lashes don't worry we have some dramatic lashes for you this is plush these are super pretty they are very flexible i hate when i buy lashes and they're like stiff and you can't really like bend them around that's so annoying but these are not like that i normally just measure it quickly i think that's good Comment down below if you guys like natural lashes or if you guys prefer dramatic lashes or if you guys are like in the middle. I hate when you're putting on with tweezers and then the tweezers get the glue stuck on it. Oh, it's so annoying. All right, guys, that is plush. These are cute too. I've noticed that I personally don't like when it zigzags, like when it crosses. I like them just straight on forward, kind of like the first ones were how they're straightforward but these ones do cross do you see that how they cross over i don't know i personally don't like that so these ones are not my fave but i will still wear them and try them out and see if maybe they'll grow on to me what do you guys think of this one it looks cute i put both on they're really pretty like i said they're not too overpowering so you can still see my eyeshadow but they're actually pretty. I feel like when I, the more that I use like the crisscross um, lashes, maybe I'll like them a little bit better. But they feel good. They don't feel uncomfortable on the eyes. A little bit more close up. Oh my god, I have to sneeze. No, anyway. These are really, really pretty actually. Alright guys, so the next one is going to be called Hipster. Honestly... These don't look too dramatic. I feel like I'm going to like these too. But do you see what I mean? How I like them straight on. I don't like it when they're crisscross. These are so pretty. Also guys, comment down below what you guys are doing for Christmas. No idea what I'm doing for Christmas. But today I am going to take photos. I am going to take photos today for my birthday photos. My birthday is December 24th. See, these are so pretty. This is so cute. Look at that. No lash with lash. Basic that bitch. I like these ones. These ones are so cute. Yo, I'm about to fight my hair. Like, for real. You need to stay. This is how they look. These are so, so pretty. Honestly, I think I'm going to wear these today for my photos. My hair better stay or else me and my hair are going to fight after this video. 
Okay, so the next one is gonna be called Celeb. Am I gonna judge them too early? I'm gonna try them on. I already know what kind of style I like. These ones are a little bit more dramatic, so if I have my dramatic people out there, these lashes are for you. Actually, these aren't bad. I'm sorry, I do not like these. I try to like them, I do not like those. Not because they're like bad quality or anything, it's just I just do not like that style. Okay, so this is how they look. You be the judge for yourself, but I personally do not love these. My poor little lashes have so much glue on them. Okay, so for the next one is called Flare. These are cute actually. I'm so tired of putting lashes on right now, <laughs> but we're almost done. I have three more, including this one. I'm just trying to put it on and go. So don't come at me if you see one popping off. Those are cute. I like these ones. And they're a little bit dramatic, but I don't mind that. They do what they say, which is flare out. These are so pretty, honestly. I feel like I'm gonna like these ones too. I'm gonna wear these ones a lot. See, they're a little bit more dramatic, but they're not out there, you know what I mean? Let me put you guys closer. So pretty. Now they do touch a little bit of my eyebrows, which is fine though. You can see this one's coming off. I'm telling you guys, do not judge me. All right. Next one. Oh, I look so weird with no lashes on. The next one is going to be called Amor. Look at my glue. <laughs> that is so ugly. Cute. Very dramatic. Comment down below, guys, where you guys get your affordable lashes or do you guys normally ball out and buy the, like, Lily lashes? Honestly, I don't even know how much Lily lashes are, but everybody tells me that they wear those or, like, um, I know jenny 69 has her lashes for like 18 or something like that honestly i cannot buy lashes like that because i just can't um i would buy coco lashes every once in a while like if i'm really really desperate for lashes and i have to go to a store that's nearby dude these are cute not my cup of tea but these are cute me and this lash are about to fight real quick can you just stick on and then my fingernails are all sticky, so that doesn't help. Cute! It's on. So these are how they look. Comment down below if these are some lashes that you would personally wear. Alright, if you guys are here till the end for the last one, you guys are a real MVP because... I'm just done. <laughs> this is in the style craze. These are actually really pretty as well. Super cute, very, very dramatic. I don't know if it's gonna be my cup of tea. Comment down below what you guys use. Do you guys use tweezers to apply your lashes or do you use your fingers? I, when I have acrylics, I normally use tweezers to apply. I just feel like they're so much easier, but since I've been trying on so many, there's glue on here, so I've been using my fingers. But honestly, I prefer the tweezers a lot better. I don't know why, it's just, it's just more useful. These are cute. Okay, let me put the other one on. I think these are as dramatic as I'll go. I like these ones. They're pretty, right? I think I'm gonna stick to these ones. I think I'm gonna wear these ones today. I don't know, but I do like these. These are cute. These are very dramatic, but I do like these. They're super cute. My final thoughts on these lashes, freaking loved majority of them. There was like one or two that I did not like. Not mad at these more dramatic ones. I honestly was like, I don't think I'm going to like any of them. So if you guys want to go ahead and grab your hands on these, I will have a link down below where you guys can grab them. And you guys can use my coupon code ROSEGOOL10 to save 10% off. And honestly, it makes a difference. You'll get these for like $4.40. And this palette too, guys, don't forget, if you guys really like how it is, I love this. I honestly feel like I might order the other two 
palettes so let me know in the comments down below if you guys would like to see a video on that $14.40 with the coupon code so you guys know which ones I liked and which ones I did not like but you guys can go ahead and choose comment down below which lashes were your guys' favorites and that is basically it don't forget to follow me on Instagram thank you guys so much for staying until the end I will see you guys in the next video bye